There is a strong demand from the uh, various quarters for banning the air, regarding the ban of the air for uh, this now in this situation. In this situation, we are having a Christmas New Year. Uh, I know your political rival had given in writing Menzi. So how are you looking at it as a member of a minority community and community and also being a minister for environment and climate change? See, first of all, Benji writing is a political stunt, to be very frank. First of all, High Court is monitoring that petition filed by somebody against sound. Now here comes, what is that petition? The petition is because of disturbance in the environment, in the, in the, in the surrounding areas where decibel meters is very high. Whereas the religious activities, I don't feel that any time there was permission taken by any church authority for making uh, the mass. So the question of arising, of taking permission does not arise. It is within the permissible decibel meters and this is a activity is going for ages together. It is not generated just now. So when she trying to give a letter to Honorable CM is something to make a political sum. I very frank. First, secondly, whenever there is to be, there is a church in the mass in the church, the, collect, the church priest just tells the police department or the collector to help in the law and order, in the sense parking and all those issues. They have never asked for permission. They don't have to ask for permission. They are free to convey the religious sentiment of the people. The government is here, the Honorable Chief Minister is here, I am there to protect all the sections of society and this is a religious activity conducted which they have to, don't have to ask. I have seen statements in the press by different priests which are not wanted for. They are free to conduct the mass because their decibel meters are within permissible limit. It is not, see, what? There is a confusion within the society. The High Court petition is for, which is being monitored, is in the 1996 Environment Petition Protection Act, 2000 noise rules, which is there in place uh, by the central government. People still believe that Madhya Pradesh State Act is followed in Goa. It is not followed in Goa. It is a central act of 2000 where the noise rules are made by the central government, which is followed by the entire country. So it is being followed. Now, it is not created by Nilesh Kabral or the Chief Minister Dr. Pramod Savan. These are created in 2000, 22 years back. Following or not following is one part of it. What is happening right now, it is the monitoring by the High Court where the collectors have been told to monitor this activity for sound decibel meters which is happening much higher. As the Environment Minister, I have already given guidelines to Pollution Control Board, who is also a nodal agency to monitor sound. Where we have given and now we are working on a system because we are getting confused in two things. One is the sound which is caught by night parties, rape parties, and one is one is the sound caused by the traditional activities. So I think we should dis distinguish between these two things. And what the High Court is monitoring is basically these uh, activities which are creating a nuisance during in the environment because of sound which will go until four o'clock in the morning, five o'clock in the morning, three o'clock, and very high decibel meters. So that is being monitored. I think High Court is very well. They have given collectors. We are also part of the High Court, the system of functioning. To change these rules, as Environment Minister, I am following up. In the past also, I have written letters to Mr. Chaudhary when he was there. I have written to uh, the present uh, uh, Central Minister. Honorable Chief Minister also has written. We are following up. It is not only for the state of Goa. And the entire country, when the rules are being framed, it is for the entire country. So it takes some time to bring in uh, whatever people's sentiments are there. We will try to frame it and get it done. But uh, as of today, there is no reason for church activities to stop. The mass has to be conducted. Everything has to go on. Not only church, including the zatras which are happening in every temple or whatever, which are happening for a particular day, one day in a year, they are please allowed. One or two days in a year, they are allowed. And they maintain the decibel meter and they will maintain it, the decorum, because that is a religious activity. Sir, how are you looking at this immediate apprehensions of the people? No, I don't know. Apprehension is not. Apprehension is not. Apprehension is not. Apprehension is not. See, what is monitored by the High Court is that a different issue by itself. Law and rules existing from 2000, 2000 and 2000, and 2000, and rule change it is not the state government, it is the central government which has changed. We have taken up and I mean, we will monitor. But right now, the priests are taking this. I think, don't think 
the administration is good we are political administration is knows where to tackle and whom to tackle as far as the church or religious activities are concerned they are within the decibel meters and they should do so the your message is clear my message is very that, clear that, uh, it should continue as it my message is very clear i have also kept a meeting on thursday with ag with the collectors with the concerned people where directions will be given that religious activities which are connected with centuries together and due to the church activities not today when sound was invented from then microphones have been used then there are decibel points are within the system so there is no question of this and high court is not monitoring these activities high court is monitoring activities which are you know which are yes. noted so yes. those are being monitored and that they will monitor the collector will monitor which they will do their job as far as this i don't think they should even require monitoring and don't have to take permission also i am telling you very clearly they will only have to write to the district administration the, the police and have to maintain the traffic and law and order that as usual they have as usual they have what they have been doing all this the question about goas r a k exclusive showroom now in margao we deal in ceramic tiles sanitary wares cp fittings and big slabs showcasing display of all products our address is mugari San Jose de Arial Salset Goa Contact us on 9545911713